Greetings guys and gals, I'm Paddock Six and Wait. Welcome back to Let's Play Lit. This is episode two. In the previous episode, we beat the English teacher boss in the first five rooms, and we're continuing now. Um, and there's a phone in this room, so I just paused it so that I don't uh, miss my chance to get it. But we just picked up a um, cherry bomb. You hold Z to use it and select your destination with A, then throw it with the Wiimote like so. And uh, yeah, it's kind of like um, the slingshot, but it's a bit different because um, it actually, uh, it can destroy nearby light sources, which comes into play later, but uh, let's get the phone first before we miss it. Alright, yeah, me too. I want to get out of here as well. I'm gonna move the mic a little closer because uh, I just hope it's not too quiet. But yeah, um, okay, so let's see. What do we have here? We have another pellet. We could get that. Um, what do you call it? That uh, window over there. I'm gonna turn this off to conserve power here. Yeah, we may as well hit this. There we go. And that gives us another light. Good. And another light, okay. So let me take a look at my power here. Can I turn this one off? I think I can, yeah. Okay, good. And that one over there. Hmm, we'll have to get to that in a second. We have another light, okay. Does this lead anywhere else? This light here? Um... Uh, I see a few lights ahead, but I can't reach them, so... Uh, can I turn this one off? Yes, I can. Okay, good. I'm gonna try turning this one back on, because I think I can use it to get to that one. Yeah? I think so. But uh, I gotta be careful with these two here now. Can I turn this one off? Yes, okay. Whew. <laughs> That's getting pretty close now. And this one on. Good. And this, I think, will open the way to the exit, but I want to make sure that nothing else will... It won't break the breaker. Can I get over here? No, I don't think so. Wait a minute. No, darn, I can't. Well... Hmm. You know... Uh, I know what I could do. Hang on a second. I can go back here, and I can turn off this one. There we go. Okay, good. I just, I had a feeling that that last light would put me over, so... I just want to double check there. Perfect! Okay, got it. So that was room 106, I think? That's pretty good. I think there's 25 rooms total? If I'm not mistaken. And I, because I think there's five bosses and there's um, a boss for every five rooms, so... Oh yeah, this one has, excuse me, it has motion sensing cameras. We'll get to those in a second. First, break that. Turn this on. So if we pass by this camera, it'll light up a large portion of the room. Um, so that'll be helpful later. And we need to get... what's this? Slingshot pellet? Okay. Um, what else do we have in this room? I know you can use the, um, the pellets near the cameras to get out. I'm just... I'm not sure if that will be enough light. Oh yeah, that's good, that's good. We just need to be quick, that's all. There we go, okay, good. <laughs> that one was pretty quick, okay. Yeah, I'll try and do five rooms per episode, but as we go on, it might get harder. And there's room 108, alright. Uh, let's see, what's this? TV remote? Okay. Where's the TV? Right there. And the phone is at the opposite end of the room. Okay. Um, is that the TV? Yeah. I'll try and get the phone first, if I can reach it in time. I'm not sure if I'll be able to. Uh, is there a good light source nearby? Here it is. Okay, good. We'll get the- Oh, dang it! I blew the breaker! Shoot, okay. We can't let that happen, alright. So, turn this on, then turn the TV on. Yeah, okay. We'll just ignore that other light at the beginning for now. Alright. Yeah, that's why you gotta be careful with your power management in this game. Um, one thing I wish they would do is show you how much each light source um, would use kind of on the- Oh, yeah, see, because I did it again! Yeah, there you go. Hmm. Can I turn- Oh, I know, I know what I should do. I should turn the TV off as soon as I'm away from that area. As soon as I turn this on, 
then I should turn the TV off. There we go. Okay, that'll probably do it. Um, but yeah, I wish they would kind of give you like a little uh, bar on here to show you how much you were going to use before you used it, but let's listen to what we have to hear. Yeah, well, not if I have anything to say about it. Hmm. Okay, well, actually, oh, can we just get to the exit from here? I think we can. <laughs> well, I didn't even think of that. Okay, cool. Thankfully, it doesn't count once you have the, the door opening animation. Okay, so 109. All right, we're almost at room 10 already. We might actually go a little further than just five... Well, I, then again, the next boss is pretty hard, so... Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. Um, I think I can reach this room here, yeah. Oh, I remember this room. This room is tough, okay. Uh, alright. Yeah, this is a tough one. I think I could turn this off, though. Just to save power for later. Yeah, you have to go all the way up here, and there's like four different fans, I think. So I'm gonna stay in the second light now. And I know I'll have to go up here. Yeah, we have to go through this area, I think, to reach the next one. Ooh. I know it's up there, but I'm just not sure where. That's another thing I wish they would do, is make other things that you could interact with light up when you get close to them. Uh, it's all the way on that end of the room. Well, can I make it all the way over there in time? Oh, ah, uh, I know it was over there. I know it was over there. Shoot. Okay. Ah, uh, dang. Okay, we'll turn this back off again. Let me use the flashlight ahead of time and see if I can... S yeah, it's right there. Okay, that's where I'm aiming for. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. We'll try that. <laughs> yeah, alright. Yeah, this next boss is very difficult, uh, so it might take us a little longer to do that, but... Okay. Let's see here. I have to follow this light. I'm not sure why fans emit so much light in this game, but uh, that's just a game, so I guess it's not that big a deal, but there's another one here. Perfect. Ooh. <laughs> oh, whoa. Oh, there's five of them now. Okay. Oh, God, I don't know which one's where. Okay. Uh, there we go. Did it. Okay, perfect. Yeah, that's a tough one. He uses five different fans. Holy crow. And 110, okay, so this is the last room before the second boss, I think. And we have a flare here. Yeah, this is the first appearance of the flares, I think. Um, you can use them to get a little bit of advantage with where you are... Uh, where you are in terms of um, ground to the next light source. You just hold A and you shake it like this. And you can walk on that little area, so that's useful. Let me see if I can quickly go get that phone or um, anything else happens. There we go. Watch out for him, Jake. He's turning everything black. He'll swallow you up if you're not careful. If you listen, you can hear him whistling. Please be careful. Whistling, huh? Okay, so there's some mysterious character that's doing a lot of whistling and is uh, covering everything in black? Okay. All right, well, um... There's another light over there. Can I turn this one off? Yes, I can. Yeah, this this room really teaches you a lot about uh, power management. I remember that. Um, so we have computer. I bet you that would overload it. Um, can we turn this one off? Yes, we can. Okay. Actually, you know what I could probably do? I could probably turn this one off. There we go. And I can turn this one off too. And then just get the computer. Which does that. Turn this one on. And then we're at max, okay. Do I have any other items? Nope. That's a computer, that's a computer. Okay, well we'll turn them off for now. Oh shoot, how am I gonna get back now? Oh, I don't think I can. Hang on, I'll reset it. Shoot, okay. Room 110 the flare again. I think you have to use the flare at the beginning. So we'll do that. Get the light. Get the other lights. 
and then we'll get that phone call again before we miss it. If you've heard the phone call already, we can't skip it, which is what I'll do. Um, just so we save a little bit of time. Does this give us anything down here? No. Okay, so we have to make sure we don't overload the power. Can we turn this off? Yeah. I think we'll do that and that. Okay, and we can turn this off too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we can still get through this whole area. Okay, that's good. Um, okay, and there's another light here. Yeah. I don't think we'll have enough... Yeah, this is the same thing that kind of happened last time, I think. Can we turn this one off? Yeah, that, okay, that'll work. Okay, perfect. So... Hmm. Let me try and... No, wait, that's not gonna work either. What about this light? Will this help? Not really, no. Shoot, okay. Um, will the computers break the breaker right now? If we turn them on? Ooh, just barely, okay. Um, shoot. Yeah, because we need to get over here. I mean, to turn this other light on first. But how are we going to get back if we don't... Hang on, let me experiment. Let me turn off the computer. Turn this on. Then turn this off. Yeah, we can't get back. Actually, no, we might be able to. Let me see. Yes, we can. Okay, good. So we can get around here, I think. Or can we not get around this desk? Yes, we can. Okay. Yeah, this is another thing. There's just tiny little gaps you have to go, ac go across like that. But we made it. There we go. Whew, okay, time for second boss time. And this one took me a little while to beat, so <laughs> I might have a bit of a, a hard time with him, but let's see. Yeah, there's the whistling. Yep, it's the janitor. And I'm not sure why this guy's a boss, but... The pellet, okay. And we're in like a cafeteria area here. Now there's loads of computers in here, but you don't want to turn them on. Because there are so many, they'll overload the breaker right away. It's kind of like a red herring sort of thing. So what's this? Slingshot pellet? Okay, I could probably break this other th uh, window over here. There we go. And what's... is this a computer over here? Yeah, we don't want to use that. Okay. Um, oh, what's this thing in a second? Okay, we should be good. Um, so yeah, we can start turning light sources on, but then every time you turn one on... Oh, I'm dead, yeah. Every time you turn a light source on, the janitor will attack it right away, so you have to be very careful there. And uh, I guess I was just a little bit off with uh, where I was standing there. Because I, uh, I died, but we'll try that again. So you can turn this on. And we can also turn on this. There we go, okay. So let's get past him and turn this on as well. And the other fan, there we go. Looks good. I'm gonna also turn these back on again. Okay. Will that actually do him in? I should, oh, get this light too. There we go. And this fan. Yeah, I think that'll help. He's gonna knock that one out. And he replenishes health every time he knocks one out too. So you have to be careful. But I think that combination of light sources would be enough to knock him out. I hope so, anyway. And uh, thankfully touching him does not actually hurt you. Oh, maybe not. He's getting his health back really quickly. Hmm. Oh boy, okay. Um, alright. Yeah, he just keeps getting it back, yeah. Uh, okay, which one's he going for? That one? Okay. I'm gonna turn this one back on. Oh, now he's going for that one over there. I'm gonna turn this on. And this on. Yeah, actually, I think we might have enough to do them this time. <gasps> yep, there we go, okay. Yeah, this one, at first, I thought I had to turn them all on sequentially, but, um... I think it's just you have to keep making sure you're turning lights on at a good rate. And then you can do them in. Yep, so there's the second boss, a janitor done. So yeah, we're at about 16 minutes. I guess we'll end it there for now, and next time... On Let's Play Lit, we will continue with room 111.